Where rest today is a public holiday, there is no room for rest for Rachel Wanga. She is on duty preparing to drive her pioneer easy bus. We found her parked alongside Nasa Road. She checks out her bus and also chats with colleagues as she waits for her co-driver to collect the fare from passengers. Mama. Once the bus is full, she hits the road heading to Kajansi. We joined her for the ride. Along the way, we engage Wanga on her daily job of riding this bus. used to it now, unless uh, in the beginning, but right now I'm very okay with it. It's, uh, since it's a big car, you don't need to drive it for long. Reason being, age matters. Because right now I have a problem with my back. But driving for long, I, I think in the next five, three years I'll be retiring. Once she gets to Kajansi, her destination, and all the passengers have disembarked, we can then fully engage her attention for an interview. Luanga reveals that driving big cars is in her blood. I had to follow my heart and follow my dream, and this is it. Although she holds a degree in fine arts from Makere University, her passion in life was driving, and she chose to pursue it. To Safeway right way, I went to Udisa. All those schools I was doing heavyweight good trust uh, truck. I, I drove a trailer from Mombasa to Kampala, and then going back, I drove a, a trail of fuel, a fuel truck from Kampala to Mombasa. However, last year, a friend of hers convinced her to try out the Pioneer buses. Again, he started to, uh, switch talking me about joining, driving the bus, whatever. So I picked the interest whereby there was my passion. So I felt like this is it. Asked about Ranga, her workmates and passengers have nothing but praise for her. She's a very working lady. I've so far worked out with her for like five months. But she likes what she does and she's very confident. But then the experience is always good. She's fast. She never really gets so, so much stuck in jam. She's punctual. Yeah, it's been a good experience with her. However, she admits it is still a challenging job. There are people who are jealous. It's this jealous person, instead of appreciating, they abuse you. So for you, you just take it easy. Smile at them, you befriend them. Whatever he says, you just turn a deaf ear and... Because it goes back to them. We asked Luanga what Women's Day means to her. It gives me the courage to empower other girls, women and whoever person of a uh, Uganda Professional Women's Association which is coming up so I'm trying to empower different girls different men uh, even men by the way so different women to come and join the struggle let me call it the struggle. Rachel Wanga is a definitive example of what women can achieve if they are given the right tools and freedoms to pursue their goals and dreams. Joyce Nakato NTV tonight.